All right, guys, welcome back to our Mitsuhide playthrough. So, where I left off last week, we were about to have kind of a showdown, kind of an unexpected showdown, really, because I thought I was going to be able to get the city. You can see there's only 82 soldiers defending the castle, and then just in the nick of time, Hideyoshi was able to get all his guys in here, so... Let me look over my stuff, and then I guess we'll fight that decisive battle. Um, yeah, because I've got eight labor. I'm not using it. We can't have that. So the plan is today, I should say tonight, hopefully be able to take out um, Hideyoshi. Okay, I can put all of them on auto. What's up, Hikari? Oh yeah, let me just say that we're probably going to go... Probably going to be doing these live streams on Saturday. At least throughout the holidays for now, so... Since uh, my Sundays are going to get... Uh, you know, more busy with everything going on, so... I don't know yet if I'm going to end up redoing the videos like what days I release my videos but I think I'm going to try to stick to the same thing same days so that's not going to change I think it's just going to be the, the live streams but we'll see um, okay everybody's on auto right now oh almost missed one Oh, you got the book in today? Awesome. Yeah, you're going to love that book. I mean, I read it nonstop. I think, I think I've read it through... At least ten times. More times than I can count for sure. It's just such a good book, you know? And that's not counting me jumping back in to, like, read my favorite chapters. Like, I have chapters in that book that are just my favorite. Um, like, um, Liu Bei's Rise After Chibi. Um, Yuan Shao versus Cao Cao. Everything that went on during that was really good. The Coalition, of course. The anti dong Zhu. I mean, there's a, just a lot of parts in that book that you're going to be, like... You know, that are going to be your favorites. That you're just going to keep coming back to, so... Okay, let's just max all this out. We'll have a decisive clash with Hideyoshi. Hopefully it's decisive anyway. We need to deal with him before... Um... You know, honestly, I'm not sure who I can expect. Who's going to win this over here? I mean... Ieyasu, I guess? He's got the best officers, right? Nobukatsu, if it wasn't for the fact that he's Nobukatsu. But he's already lost his territories here. I can't imagine that he's going to hold on to Mino and uh, Owari for much longer. I feel like Ieyasu is probably just going to run away with this at some point. I don't know when he's going to start moving, but whenever he does, he's going to start to take off. So I can't see the I can't see Nobukatsu being able to uh, administer well the AI. I mean, wow, four volumes total. That's a lot of fucking volumes. I've never had the book, you know. Like I said, I've always. <laughs> I always, when I was a kid, I used to uh, print out the the stuff in my library, at, at my school library, and then as I got older, at the library, and then as I got older, I just read it online all the time. So, all right, so let's start this off. I have no idea how many troops I had left. I'm, we're gonna just find out, I guess. We do have Nobuyuki Sanada, so we are blessed. If you guys haven't seen my other live streams, whenever. Whenever you get a Sonata kid shows up, you know that you're in, you're in uh, good hands. You know what I mean? As soon as a Sonata retainer shows up to your force, 
from out of nowhere from out of nowhere you know the the future's bright oh Saito's only down to 600 that's too bad I was looking to uh, use his decapitator trait I haven't been able to put Saito to work yet so if you guys don't know Saito has the decapitator trait he's the only person who has it right basically this guy increases the chances of inflicting injuries and um, killing pretty much I don't know what the percentage is but it's pretty consistent so if you have Saiso on your team if you find yourself using him in any of your playthroughs have him finish off units when possible and you will inflict casualties all the time pretty consistently it's kind of crazy I found him on my first playthrough as the Azai and um, yeah he's the only one who has it nobody else has the trait which is kind of a bummer I mean you could always edit and all that but outside of that it's just him I don't like this map <coughs> I don't like this map because the it ends up being a, a mosh pit right here around the inspire and my armies are never set up for a mosh pit I don't know why they're just they're just not pretty much guarantees a lot of attrition also all right this doesn't look good if I'm being honest their numbers are distributed uh, better hmm Who's this? Wave of Despair confuses enemy units that are at war when your soldier count decreases to a certain level. Wow. Yoshitsugu Otani. This guy has two different ways to confuse abuse. That's concerning. is pretty good. Um... Okay, you, oh, there, there's three guys with three different ways to get confused. That's no good. Okay, so why don't we start this? Why don't we start this stream off with a gamble? Uh, just to see. Why don't we start the stream off by rolling the dice? You know what I mean? Let's play a little dangerously. So. We'll have our weaker forces in the center, and we'll send our stronger forces to the right. And let's just see if the center can hold. I think I'll leave the job to Hidemitsu. Nobuyuki's got musket fire, though. I don't know if that's going to make a huge difference. Should we put Mitsuhide in the center? Should we risk our uh, liege lord? We could do it like this. Okay. So here's the plan. Mitsuhide holds the center. Nobuyuki and his uh, and uh, son-in-law there, Hidemitsu, go towards the right. Try to break through. And uh, we don't do anything at all about the left because we can't. <laughs> we can't we're out of uh, no options there you know I want to use this tactic but it takes forever to charge it's so slow it really needs a buff um, his gold plated ability it just it takes forever by the time he's ready to use, now is the time he's going to be exhausted. You know, that's the problem. He's got confused. Alright, we'll do this. Let's do this. Let's do that. I'm probably going to lose my confuse ability. But let's do that. I do hope that, yeah, that the 
Hojo and the Nagao counter Ieyasu because I really, I really don't want um, Ieyasu to just run away with the map. But I don't know if anything could be done about it, honestly. All right, so we're gonna go. We're gonna roll to the right. Try to wheel around. So I'm I'm relying on these two, on Sana the boy, and the heated me too, to break through. Somebody's got to break through over here. In the meantime, we're just gonna hold on for dear life. That's the play. And uh, if we don't win, we don't win. <laughs> as long as nobody dies, right? Oh, you know what? I don't have enough to send over here. I just realized that. Maybe we can give them the Inspire. Can I just give them the Inspire spot? I think so. Let's play defense. We'll give him the spot. We'll just stay out of the AoE. Because we have guys who need to charge their tactics. We have a Confuse that needs to charge. Mitsuhide needs to charge, which is going to take an, uh, an eternity. Ooh, they're only bringing one guy. That's a mistake. You already goofed. You done goofed. Where's our camp? Is it all the way back here? Yeah. You know what? I think we need to route this guy. Otherwise, he's just going to turn around. And then I won't be able to put pressure on the camp. I need to get Saiso with this little 600... Soldier squad all the way up here just to keep uh, Kiyomasa pinned down. Alright, they're coming for the camp. We're going for their camp. They're going for our camp. Can I cross over? Okay, let's go for the Inspire instead. Yep. Hidemitsu is going to roll this guy up right away. I don't know why the AI kept him by himself. I thought it was going to be two on two over here, but it's not. So it's going to be a straight shot to the enemy camp. Where's Saizo? Okay, he's going for the Inspire. He's just got a hold here. Okay, yeah, there he goes. Wait a minute. How did he get by you? What? How did he just walk by the road? If he's if his unit is here, how did they walk right by him and get to the camp? Oh, that's nonsense. That's total nonsense, but alright, that's fine. I guess we better prepare to lose our main camp then. Okay, let's get into position to take theirs. If that's how it's gonna be. I can't believe that. How did they walk by him like that? 
What? Okay, that's fine. We should be able to take theirs back. As long as we don't lose by morale. I'm going to have Mitsuhide fall back to the camp because he's going to be confused and I don't want to risk him taking any damage. Oh, he didn't even get to use his confuse. That guy's having a bad day. They must have put on Akechi uniforms and just walked right by. <laughs> it's the only way. How else would they just walk right by us like this? That made no sense, man. Alright, Saito's on his way to threaten the camp. All, that's all he's got to do. And I'm going to keep Hiramitsu here since we're going to be confused in a second. I don't want us to get beat up too badly. Okay. Yeah, I think it was a bug. Pretty big bug, if you ask me, too. Alright. It's okay, though, because we got our guys in position to threaten the camps. So, look, Kizomasa's got to pull back. They're probably going to need another, another unit to pull back, so they're going to break up their forces and that's where I'll win as soon as they break up their forces they all want to come towards Mitsuhide that's fine too you guys sure you want a pizza Mitsuhide I could probably take his camp right now if I wanted to but All right, I'm not going to move Mitsuhide to the road so that this doesn't happen again because apparently units can just walk right by you. So, okay, I've learned my lesson, Koi. Oh, I didn't know that was Nagamasa. Let's get him. Don't let him get away. Perfect. Now is the time. The time to say no to poor, poor... Poor uh, programming and bugs. Time to say no to Koei. And still win the battlefield. Alright, don't kill him. Capture him. He injured him. I told Saiso don't kill him. He couldn't help himself. He still had to, he still had to get an injury in. All right, now all these guys should be destroyed. As soon as we confuse, Mitsuhide should be able to just beat them up. That's my guess anyway, we'll see. Hurry up, Nobuyuki. We're losing soldiers here. Thank you. The pendulum swings back in our favor. Now we just beat him up for a bit. Oh, I forgot about the confused. Where's this guy going? Oh, they're rotating their units. That's right. Thanks to the update. I do appreciate that update, Koei. Mitsuhide is just going to hold strong. That's all he's got to do. He's got to hold on. Just hang tough. What's up, pizza? Yeah, he couldn't. He couldn't do it. I said, try not to, try not to kill anybody. And uh, after I gave the order and I walked away, Saiso so sharpened his blade, and he's like, hmm. He didn't say don't stab anybody. He said don't kill. He didn't say anything about stabbing. So, 
Nagamasa took a stab. She's got a tank. She's got a tank. All the hits. All their forces are tired. Nowhere to go. Where are you going? Where are you going? Captured somebody. Great. That's what we like to see. You want to confuse? That's fine. We've got Nobuyuki back there. He can step in. We can run a rotation just like you can. Yeah, I hope we can capture this Yoshitsugu. We need to act, capture and execute him. He's too dangerous to let live. What with this double confuse? Too dangerous. Too dangerous to keep alive. Yeah, it's a fair trade. Let's get him. Let's get him. Oh, jeez. Help. Somebody help this guy. Nobuyuki saves the day again. Nobuyuki just joined. He's already saving our asses. This guy's confused me four times. Four times. He's a menace. He's a menace. He needs to be stopped. I'm like Jonah Jameson, and he's like he's the Peter Parker of uh, Japan right now. He's an absolute menace. All right, that's the second unit chewed through. We're gonna we're gonna get to Yoshitsugu. Don't worry. Five confused. That's confused number five. Mitsuhide is about to rout. Good lord. Oh, I think we killed... I think we just killed Mitsunari's father. Whoops. Big whoops right there. What's up, Daniel? Can we just put this guy in the ground, please? I'm done with this guy. I never want to fight him again. Ugh, we didn't capture him. Alright, Kizomasa is the only one left. Wow, talk about a tough opening battle. Saizo's going to have to tank the hit because he's got concerted attack. Or he's got rapid assault, whatever. He's going to deal a lot of damage is what I'm trying to say. Here, I got to bring him around. You know, it'd be nice if we could get a camp that could restore soldiers. Maybe not a lot of soldiers, but some soldiers that you could rest. No, forget I said it. Forget I said that, actually. That's, yeah, you could just abuse the hell out of that. I don't know what I was thinking. Alright. Sorry, Saiso, you gotta take that hit. 
Oh, that wasn't that bad. Man, this this battle was a near disaster thanks to uh Koei's programming department. <laughs> near disaster. Yeah, this was brutal, and it didn't have to be, Ikari, but this... That bug where he just let them right by the road, I mean, it felt like it was straight out of a Monty Python, you know... Monty Python sketch right there, where they just... They must have worn Akechi uniforms and just walked right by into the camp. It was uh, South Tsao's raid on uh, Wu Chao. Same kind of deal. Oh wow, this guy's really good. Can we can't recruit him? He's got a loyalty of twenty. That means he must be family, right? Tadayasu Maeno. Thankfully, they added this tab so you can actually see the officer information. You couldn't do this before. He became a Ronin after he served Mitsunari Ishida and died at the Battle of Sekigahara. Oh no, he's not a. Uh, one of the Wake Eight. Does anybody know what that's referencing? Is that like a Tiger General? Eight famous Toyotomi retainers. He's not family. He doesn't have familial ties. We're gonna let him go. I will not be taking your head. Correct. All right, we got an authority trigger. Only 82 soldiers left holding the castle. I should be able to take this castle. That's right, Hideyoshi. It's not looking good for you. All right, just storm this thing. Send Saiso in there, let him get crazy, take some heads, whatever. You know, do his thing. Takeda Castle. I feel like Nobuyuki should run this castle. You guys aren't seriously coming over here. Okay, I was going to say. Okay, so we're making a dent. I mean, we've pretty much broken Hideyoshi's power, but... You know how the AIs in this game, they're going to restore their soldiers, like, in the blink of an eye. I feel like they restored their soldiers a lot faster than the player does. Goods pillaged. Really? We just got here. We don't have any gold. Um, let's take this castle quickly. Yep. Yusai, time to prove your loyalty. He only has supplies for 60 days. Well, what can I say? You're going to have to tighten your belt. How long is it going to take? 30 days, so you'll only be able to attack for 30 days. Yeah, that's not going to cut it. All right. I'll let you off the hook this time. All right. Nobukatsu hasn't invaded yet, ever. So I feel like I've rolled pretty high with the RNG on this playthrough because if you guys remember the Nobunaga survives Honganji stream Nobukatsu was really being a kind of a knucklehead you know just a rebellious just a rebellious uh, kid against his father I guess but uh, a rebellious youth if you will 
But he was attacking pretty frequently in that. Of course you do. The Sutsui. I don't really want to fight the Psycho Rebels, but I guess. Guess I'll help you out. Oh, we're playing on hard, Daniel. Land holder of on you. Who is this guy? Worst tactic in the game. Why does this guy want so much stuff? Um, put him on the new castle. There you go, that's the best I can do. Yeah, I'm playing on hard right now on this playthrough. I'm thinking, though, in the future, I might step it up and start playing on EX hard. It just kind of depends on how tedious, um, how much more micro I need to play on EX hard. That's the thing I'm thinking about, so... I think I should give Saiso his own castle. That makes a lot of sense to me. What is it? It's like giving Saiso his own castle is like that expression in Three Kingdoms when they're like, it's like giving, uh, letting a wolf into the sheep's den or uh, giving a wing, giving a tiger wings. They say that in the books a lot. Especially when uh, Liu Bei gives um, Lu Bu land. When Liu Bei lets Lu Bu stay in his territory, his advisors are against it. And you're like, it would be like giving a tiger wings. You know? Alright, he's got... We'll put you on auto. You can just attack. You know what you're going to do. You're going to just... Increase the body count in your in your area over here. Alright, sneak attack, no surprise there. Our necromancer. What are the chances? Well we don't have any money for that. I think it would work. He's only got a fifty three intelligence. We'll have to come back to it, because I really don't have the gold for it. Very, our economy is pretty much in the toilet right now. Only two months remain with the Ashikaga clan. Two months with the Chosokabe clan. I don't think these alliances really matter over here. It'd be cool to form an alliance with the uh, Ukita clan. We can use them as a buffer against the Mori. But the Mori are cooperative with us, so... Okay. I didn't know that pizza, thanks. Ashikaga in 1582. Okay, I might have to try it out. Is it it's pretty much this, right? They're just uh hanging out here. Yeah, that's what I'm worried about EX Hard, that it's just a small... The larger powers are going to snowball too quickly. That's why I haven't played it yet. 
because the map is just gonna kind of solve itself very quickly so I'm not in a rush to be like one of the I'm not in a rush to be in that game state where you're one of three very large powers and you're just endlessly attacking like I'm in no rush to be there you know I don't want to hit end game that quickly so in the romance games it's pretty much the same deal and that becomes very boring very quickly like the first two times you see it you're like okay this is cool but when you're on your fifth sixth seventh playthrough and uh you started you just started playing that afternoon and it's already an endless slog between uh three different powers it's it gets real tedious real fast I need to take this castle. How many days do I have? Oh, they're agitated forever. Okay. Perfect. What's he executing goodwill? Hang on. Mitsuhide's doing goodwill with who? Doesn't say. Oh, the Shibata clan. That's right. We're gonna have uh we're gonna ask Katsue to invade Mino province. Destabilize Mino. That's gonna be that's the play. We get Katsue to destabilize Mino and so invite Ieyasu. We just try to turn this whole region into a powder keg. That's what I wanna try to do here. It's just just get everybody fighting over here so I can keep focusing on trying to put down Hideyoshi. That way I don't have to worry about Nobukatsu invading me. Because if Nobukatsu invades, if he sends all his legions like into our flank here, into these, these castles here, then I'm going to be hard pressed. I'm going to have to turn around. And I feel like that's <laughs> that's how I'll lose. Is if I if I give Hideyoshi time to recuperate, like it's it's game over, man. Like that's gonna be it. And like I said, it's weird that he's that Nobukatsu's not attacking. Because when I did the, uh, when I played the Nobunaga uh, playthrough last week, I think it was last week, which was that was Nobunaga surviving Honganji. So if you guys didn't see that, that's on the channel. I think it's only two parts, but that was pretty interesting. But yeah, in that Nobukatsu just charged that Nobunaga over and over again. He was more aggressive than anybody else. So. Like I said, I don't know if it's just uh, a kid rebelling against his dad. You know, I don't know if he was just trying to show, flex on his old man a little bit, you know, but it certainly felt personal. I agree, Kari. We do need coalitions back in the game. I miss coalitions. I miss having half the map march against you, you know. Alright, do you guys think we should redo a deal with the Tsutsui clan? They have 700 soldiers. <laughs> should we get an alliance with them? Should we renew the alliance or what? <laughs> Their strength is 700 soldiers. I, I kind of want to... Get an alliance done with the, the Suzuki clan. Get the Psycho Rebels on the on the squad. You know what I mean? Oh, everyone here is busy though. Let's wait for the uh, for Mitsuhide to finish, and then we'll start talking to. Uh, we'll open negotiations with the Psycho. Taking a long time to recover soldiers here. I don't know why. You think we should just wipe them out? We will get Sakon Shima on the team. Alright, let's ask Katsue to invade Nobukatsu. And hopefully start a huge powder keg. Oh, 
Look at that. There was already Potter Keg happening. Nobukatsu's already moving. Nobukatsu's attacking Ieyasu. Is he? Hang on. I don't want to interrupt that. Is he going to beat Ieyasu? It is a lot of soldiers. At least double the soldiers Ieyasu's got. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe just a small... Just a small invasion, so it doesn't have to be anything great. But I can ask Katsue to attack. Let's see, because it'll tell you what forces. It'll tell you what he's going to deploy, so... Three units here. Three. Four. That's a pretty small attack. Small attack. You know what? I'm just going to have him send a huge force. Who cares about Nobukatsu? I don't. That should turn his armies around. Some of them. Okay, we need to take this castle. How are we looking? Are we ready to march? Doesn't look like it. Looks like we're still recuperating. Okay. 2,000 gold. Let's see if our Necromancer can successfully uh, kill this guy. He's going to prove his powers. Okay. Do I have any spots open? We have one spot open. This guy's got eloquence though. He can do goodwill. Alright, let's start talking to Saika. We'll get a deal done with them since Tsutsui are going to collapse. We'll just make an alliance with Saika instead. Come on, Yusai, hurry up. Can't trust this guy at all. New mineral. Yeah, we don't have any money. All right, so Katsue's coming down into Mino. This is a mess. Look at this. I don't think Ieyasu's in any real danger, even though his forces look a lot smaller, but... I don't know. Nobukatsu's so inept. Diplomacy quit. Why is that? We're hostile. Why are we hostile? Alright. That was random. Completely random. All of a sudden it was just like, hey, we're not friends anymore. <laughs> He's going to run out of troops. Might as well just storm. Recruit craftspeople. I've never seen this before. Musket plus three. Wow. How much do we need? Can do that now? Muskets plus three. Holy crap. Katsue Shibata's uh, soloing Nobukatsu's army. 
in Mino. Let's watch that. That's that's more entertaining. Oh my God! He's just destroying everybody. Uh, yeah, we'll do that. We'll back the Shibata clan. I don't know how, guys, but for some reason, uh, Katsue has warmed up to Mitsuhide. I mean, I don't know how, I don't know why, but... We're friends now. Wow, they can't stop him. No, Bukatsu can't stop him. How many days do you have? 13 days of provisions, huh? Alright, I guess you should withdraw. Yusai has got to be the most questionable retainer I have. Guy barely helps. Great stats, but he barely helps. He just bulldozed through everybody. Incredible. The power of Katsue. Our necromancer successfully inflicting inflicted a, a wound. A festering wound. That a catchy black sorcery. That vile necromancy. Uh, oh, this guy looks cool. Stats aren't great, but he looks cool. Welcome to the team. This, oh my god, just destroying. Katsue Shibata is just destroying everybody. I think we made the most important friend we're going to make in this whole run. Um, Let's see. Can I just build the training grounds? Because you're taking forever to build it, man. I uh, wish I could put Mitsuhide. What is Mitsuhide doing right now? Oh, he's building our muskets, right. I need Mitsuhide to build that training ground because he's got um, that trait 100 poems. We're about ready to march. We need, uh, what, provisions? Yeah, we're a little provision short, but that's about it. Ninja Palace. Raise. No, we're not doing that. All right, let's watch Katsue just solo the center of Japan, apparently. <laughs> Grown suspicious. Oh, no, not that guy. What's his loyalty down to seven? I can't do anything about that. That's way too low. If he joins Hideyoshi, I mean, he's pretty much signing his own death warrant. Okay, Mitsuhide's freed up. Let's get a training grounds up here. Not trading town, trading grounds. Oh, he's not freed up. Because I have this on, uh, let's take it off. No. He must not be back yet. Still going. Yeah, is actually losing some ground. Holy crap. Yasu yeah, might be wiped out. This is weird. I guess if you don't have that event turned on that gives him uh, the free territory, he actually has to fight. I don't understand. Why is he not available? Oh, I think I have to do it like this, right? No? Hmm. 
He's not doing anything else. I don't understand. What's up, TJ? Um, no, I always just forget. That's all. I just forget normal targeting. And every time you bring it up, I'm like, shit, I need to use normal targeting. What's up sometimes? Yeah, um, that's what I was saying. So I played this earlier. Oh, uh, not earlier. When I did this last week, I played Nobunaga Survives Honganji, uh, which I have on the channel. So if you haven't seen it, if you're, if you're watching this, you're not sub to the channel, make sure you sub to the channel and go watch that because that was pretty cool. Trying to survive as Nobunaga was, it was a little dicey in the beginning. But anyway... One of the things about that is that Nobukatsu attacked me relentlessly. And now he hasn't invaded at all. He's invading Ieyasu. And uh, we have Katsue invading him. So I'm just trying to keep Nobukatsu busy. Because I learned last week that he can be a real nuisance just attacking you. He's not strong enough to like do any serious damage. But the problem is Nobukatsu can tie you down. And then Hideyoshi can actually come in and mess you up. You know, at least that's my guess. We've been winning against Hideyoshi, so. I haven't been on the receiving end of, like, a beatdown <laughs> yet, you know. We haven't had any Ujizane blunders on this playthrough. That doesn't mean that we won't, but. I almost had a disaster at the beginning of this stream. Almost had a total disaster. But that was more, uh, that was Koei's fault, not mine. Katsue is just destroying all of his reserves. All Noble Katsu's reserves are gone because of one, one man. I think we saved Ieyasu. I think it was the right call, too, because if he would have had more soldiers, I think that would have been it. I think Ieyasu would have gotten completely overrun. Whereas now it's going to take a little bit longer, which is good for me. Alright, we have a little bit of money. We're going to spend money in, money out. Okay, TJ, we're going to take your recommendation and actually use the march command, which I should be using all the time. But I'm glad that you showed up because I wouldn't have done it. I would have for I would completely escapes my mind all the time to use march. I'm going to say the middle castle so that we draw all of Hideyoshi's forces. We're not going to have our back line join in. I don't think I can use Saiso. I don't think saiso has got enough troops. I guess I'll bring him, but I don't... He's not strong enough to be effective just yet. And we'll leave these two here in case we want to invade uh, the Sutsui clan. If we see an opportunity to wipe them out while we're fighting Hideyoshi, I'll do that. Alright. You have your orders, X-Men. Godspeed. 50 gold. Alright, almost broke. Let's watch Katsue destroy this guy with the end of his strength. At the very last of it. Who'd we get? Hmm. 
Yeah, um... Yeah, in, in the um, Uesugi playthrough, I think if I would have marched TJ, I would have been a totally different playthrough. I think that made the difference for me. If I would have remembered that, I would have uh, captured the Uesugi capital. And, yeah, I would have kept going. I, I think if I do that run, if I ever do that run again, it'll be uh, way different just because of the march. That would have broken the deadlock, the extra supplies. Yeah, I hope he doesn't defect, but we'll see. Yeah, the Nobunaga start, the hardest thing about the Nobunaga start is that he doesn't have the officers. I think Nobukatsu is militarizing against me. He's all red here. But where? That's weird. I don't see any... Katsue is just a beast, man. I still remember that uh, Ujizane, the Imagawa stream, when he soloed my army like three different fights. He pretty much turned back my armies three times in three different fights. Every time I fought Katsue, it was just like... It was just not pretty, dude. It was not pretty. Betrayed us. What a traitor. Kazuma. Oh, let's give Kazumasa his own castle. That's fine. Now you want to talk about loyalty problems, too, um... Mitsuhide's got a lot of loyalty problems. Over half his force... Well, I'd say about half his force. I'm exaggerating. About half of the force is yellow. Loyalty's about 12 or 13, right on the line. I think if I played on EX hard, I'd probably be dealing with that all the time as well. Peace tribe, let's do that. You never know. Bondbreaker ploy against uh, the Oda. The Oda clan are allied with the Suzuki clan. That's really weird. That's really weird. Since they're historically enemies. Alright, we're just waiting to be able to militarize. As soon as we can march. We'll have another big battle with uh, Hideyoshi. guy's such a jackass. Settlement on fire. Yeah, you don't say. Alright, let's search. We found Nobuyuki by searching, and we also found um, Kazumasa was just sitting around, apparently. Apparently, Kazumasa is just sitting around around this time period at home, not doing anything. So if you're playing 1582, you can just search in the center and you'll find Kazumasa just hanging out. Ikari, that's a pretty big tip. I didn't know that. But I didn't know anything about marching, really. I always forget about it. He was hostile at the start uh, sometimes, but he was hostile at the start, but I don't know what happened. I don't know if I won an authority trigger battle last week and that changed his stance. I honestly don't know. I just remember I hovered over and he was cooperative. So I must have won an authority battle last week. And that's what changed everything. So as soon as I saw that, we got the alliance done. 
So having him on our side is going to be crazy because, I mean, he's a one-man wrecking crew. Add a ranch or develop a silver mine. It's going to be a weird force. We're going to have guns. We're going to have muskets and cavalry. At this rate. Insufficient goal. Oh, okay. We're a bit too short. Alright. We'll wait. I think Iyasu's finished. Even the Hojo are attacking. Oh, so the Hojo got a deal done with the Oda. Oh, no, they don't. Okay. So how'd you get here? Oh, okay, I see. This little straight passage. Wow, yeah, Yasu's going to be finished. Cool. Very cool. I won't have to deal with him. Okay. You couldn't find any Ronin. That's fine. We see some red. Some of our castles are almost done. Let's get this cavalry. We can't get it yet. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. Hey, what's up, Dan? Dragoons. Man, I, w I really miss dragoon units from, um, from the older games, from Rise to Power and Iron Triangle. They were so incredibly strong. We don't have the cash, right? No, we need a little bit more. Got to get to the end of the month. Oh, and sometimes it's funny that you say that the game advances very quickly because I feel the same way. I feel like I sit down, I play this game for an hour and a half, and three years go by. You know, like that in the blink of an eye. It's been three years. Who's this? Oh, okay, she's an actual... Uh, all right, guys, we need a name. Let's hear it. What do we name our uh, Mitsuhide's fictional uh, daughter here? I'm thinking Ujizana. <laughs> Mitsuhida. Kuni Mitsu Ujiza <laughs> What the fuck? Ujizanita? Alright. Ujizanita or Kuni Mitsu. Alright, somebody somebody throw in the tiebreaker. Vote for one or the other. Kuni Mitsu or Uji Uji's I can't even say it. Ujizanita. What a name. I'm thinking Kunimitsu just because it's easy to pronounce. Yeah, I'm gonna go Kunimitsu. Kunimitsu. We'll get we'll get Uji Uji Zanita on the next one. Just remind me, she's got gunnery. Oh shit! Yeah, Iron Triangle was amazing. I'd like to stream that someday, but I only have it on the PlayStation, so I'd have to get it on the laptop, and then uh, get get all that done. Figure out how to do that. I'm kind of hoping now that we're getting a Romance 8 remake, and it's the first remake from Koei, maybe in, I don't know, 5 years down the road, 10 years down the road, we'll get an Iron Triangle remake, or a Rise to Power remake. Alright, I think we're ready to march.
Resolved in one day. All right, you have one day. Who's this? Miyoshi. What's potential do? Stamina restored. She is the wife of Kenyo Honganji. Why is she here? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I really missed the unit variety from uh, Iron Triangle. The research branches, you know, how you could get different technologies and you had clan unique unique clan technologies. In this game you have policies, but in that game you had tech that was unique to each clan. You still don't have provisions. This guy's killing me right now. How do you not have provisions, man? Oh, okay, because you have a ton of training grounds. Yeah, I, I can see that now. <laughs> Perhaps I've judged you harshly. Let's just send the confused guy then. That's always useful. Oh, still not enough. All right, just stay put. No supplies here either. I said it in my Uesugi playthrough. I will say it again. I always have supply problems in this game. I guess we'll just wait because we don't have provisions. We'll give it another month. Yeah, that's why I don't post because the quality of it is going to be bad because the PS3 gra graphics. Uh, a, buddy, a buddy of mine told me there's something you can get to smooth it out, make it HD, but I'd need him to come over and hook set it up for me because I don't know how to do that. He says there's a very simple way to do that. And the, the muskets were easy mode. You're absolutely right. I used to like archery. I'd roll with Yoshimoto. Yoshimoto had, uh, the Imagawa have a unique tech that's for musket, uh, not muskets, for, um, for archery. And since archery was like the worst, <laughs> arguably the worst type, I used to have a lot of fun uh, rolling the Imagawa in that game. We need some gold. All right, that's fine. Be patient. Oh, our alliance is almost over? We can't have that. No, no, no. I think we need to marry off our... Uh, our daughter to the, to the Shibata clan. We need to strengthen the alliance. What is this guy doing? Okay, let's put the ranch up finally. And that's it. Alright, can we get small unit deployment level 2? No officers available. We need officers to do any of these policies right now. Yeah, I used to like that. You have a much higher chance of taking out officers. One of the older romances had that too with uh, bow units. Like sniper formation had a higher chance of just injuring officers. 
And that's a lot of fun. That's that's what these games need to have a little bit more of. They need to have more um more RNG. Because you can play hyper efficient, you know what I mean, like a few times. But once you once you've done the uh, optimal route. Then that's kind of it, you know. Then you need to change it up. And uh, the Kuwait's kind of weird. Some other games have a lot of RNG, and some don't. They just kind of vary. Reinforcements to attack the Oda. Yeah, yeah, we'll do that. Who's going? Yeah, you can go. <laughs> Okay, we have a lot of soldiers. Hideyoshi should have a lot of soldiers. We should be able to uh, have a big battle if my supplies are up to speed. Alright, we're going to go for it anyway. I'm tired of waiting for supplies. I don't even want the castle. I just want to... I just want to wipe out some soldiers. <laughs> we have enough food for that? Can we just, can we at least fight something decisive against our uh, nemesis here? What does this guy do? Enlightened Blade, what is that? Nullifies Confusion. And reduces the defense of enemy units. Wow, that's just insane. Nullifies confusion and reduces defense. Whoa. Hang on, let's give him the other... Munenori Yagyu? All right, Mitsuhide with his faithful advisor slash necromancer. No, but Yuki can't really pull much. This territory's got some poor yield, man. Very poor yield. Now we're going to click on the castle so that the AI knows that we're going straight for the castle. So they can get all their little guys together. Can I put somebody else in charge here? This guy does not seem great. Kunimitsu? We could march out Kunimitsu. Why not? Let's okay. Let's switch her. Let's put her here. Oh, what is what territorial problem is she working on? Border dispute. Okay, she's in, she's busy. Supplies are still pathetically low. I think I'm just gonna break one of the training grounds and. When I started the run, I was anticipating like a huge invasion, so I was just gathering up troops. I thought I'd be on the defensive, but I never was, so... You know, kind of like when I played the Imagawa run, I was... Shingen was invading right away, so... That's what my mindset was with this one, but... That hasn't turned out to be the case. Hmm, he is not ready either. Not enough provisions. Okay, we can let them sit back for a month. What is this guy doing? What? Oh, okay. 
Okay. Calling the banners. Let's go put Hideyoshi in the ground. We're like a bully right now, you know what I mean? Hideyoshi's trying to pick himself off the ground, we're just gonna kick him. We're just gonna kick him while he's down. Alright, um... I think that's everything I could pull. These guys up front barely have any supplies, so we're gonna wait for them to get closer. I don't care about that. They still have to deal with Katsue. I think he was free. Sometimes, yeah, I think that officer was free. Oh my god, I just can't stand it. Even in romance, I hate the whole, you know, subterfuge tactics like Sao Sao does against you. Oh, it's so frustrating. This guy, 74, 78, Confuse, and he has tactics, 15 years old. Tokugawa Retainer, oh, speaking of Tokugawa Retainers, he was Hidetada's page but left the clan. After the siege of Osaka, he returned and established a military academy, training many officers. I believe it. This guy has great stats, great traits, on the offensive, wow, look at this lineup. Confuse, on the offensive, and tactics. Very strong. All right, Hideyoshi, are you gathering your guys here? I hope so. I hope so, bud. All right, let's get up to the stronghold. All forces, right to the stronghold, right there. Except for you, because you need supplies, so... You're going to sit on top of the castle and use their supplies. And we call up the tribesmen, there's only one, right? There was more tribes here, but I guess by this starting date they've been um, assimilated. Because I remember uh, on the Shogun playthrough there was more tribe units here, around these castles. Also, does anybody know where the devils are? The blue devil and the red devil? Are they gone already? Oh, you're going to attack already, Hideyoshi? You're not going to wait? You're not going to wait. It'll be a bigger battle if you wait. What are we looking at? Four on four? Hideyoshi's eager. He's been pushed around for long enough. Actually, I'm the one who's been pushed around. What am I talking about? Alright, let's see how this battle will look. I hate when, you, when they jump away like this, because then you can't catch the pause again. Okay, four against four. We're slightly outnumbered. We've got 3,000 on the way. We've got more help on the way. How much help does he have? Oh, he's got Kanbei. You know what? I don't actually want to fight Kanbei. I do not want to fight Kanbei Kuroda. 
I think we're going to fight this right now. I don't want to deal with this guy. Does he have that Yoshi, uh, Yoshitsugu? Okay, he's not here. Yeah, I don't want none of Kanbei. Yeah, we're gonna fight him. I'm gonna have to. I don't want to face uh, Kanbei or Yoshitsugu in a big battle because I lose track of them. And then when I when I remember that they're there, it's because they're confusing the hell out of my forces, you know? So I definitely don't want to fight them. It's too much brain power to keep track of them and where they are and all that good stuff. Okay. This guy's also got Calculating Genius. Horrible. And he... Oh, that is Yoshitsugu. Wait a second. His portrait's changed. Oh, you tricked me. <laughs> you tricked me. He covered his face, and I, I forgot. I didn't recognize that it was him. Calculating Genius and Wave of Despair. That is him. Damn. Well, good thing I didn't fight Kanbei as well, because then I would have had to deal with uh, a whole nother thing. Alright, how do we do this? Rory and Mitsuhide. I guess Kazumasa's got to go this way so he can engage first. Enlightened Blade nullifies confusion. Oh, maybe this guy's... Wait a second. We have the counter. Hard counter. Munenori will nullify the confusion. Oh, Yoshitsugu. Take that. Kazumasa down the middle where he can trigger his first blood. His Rambo effect. Mitsuhide down the center to back up. Our son-in-law, I don't know what to do with him. Whoops. Okay, this looks good. Let's try this. He's got leprosy? Oh off well he's um what's his name isono is going to get the first blood trigger so i want him to get that extra attack strength that's why i want him out in the front yeah, I didn't know that Yoshi Yoshitsugu gets uh, leprosy. That's brutal. Horrible. Kazumasa's gonna trigger that. We'll threaten the camp. Keep Hideyoshi back there. Perfect. Almost lost <laughs> almost lost the spot trying to get uh first blood to trigger, but it worked out. Hideyoshi's not moving, that's, that's a huge mistake. Okay, 
All right, let's move up. Ooh, musket fire. That's how you know Mitsuhide's arrived. Musket fire with uh, incendiary rounds. That's Mitsuhide's personal preference. Yeah, I didn't think Kazumasa was going to hold on for very long, but that's alright. He did some damage. Come on, guys, hurry. We're taking a beating over here, hurry. I gotta fall back. I can't take too much damage, man. He's gonna go for the camp, right? That's fine. Actually, you know what? Let's do it like this. I'll send Yusai after Kisamasa. What happened? What happened to Enlightened Blade? Nullifies confusion when receiving a tactic from the, an enemy and reduces defense of nearby enemy units. Where's the nullifying? Oh boy. No nullification. Oh, I guess it nullifies baseline confusion. I'm sure that's what it is. Lame. Lame. A gold-plated tactic that doesn't help against other gold-plated effects. Great. Alright, just stay there. Are you hitting him? Okay. As long as you're hitting him. Well, that mistake was costly. <laughs> Incredibly costly. I don't think we can win now. Tuhide's got to route this guy. Yeah, I don't know why he ran. It's like, um, it's like sometimes it's saying, some, it just depends. Different units have different thresholds. No allied unit within range? He looks like he's within range. Okay. Okay. 
Yeah, I don't think uh, Mitsuhide is going to be able to take this guy. I can't believe it doesn't counter. That guy's confused. Ah. This guy's pulling out all the confuses that he's had for just this moment. That's perfect timing. I gotta give him that. So we've gotta try to save the camp somehow. We've got to save the camp and break Hideyoshi's, uh... No, we're just not going to make it. This guy's, uh, Kiyomasa's just going to chew up the camp there. Man, that counter confuse. It really cost me the battle. Alright, Ikari, I'll catch you later, man. Hopefully I can recover my position, because that was pretty brutal. Man, I can't believe I lost this fight. Oh, we're not weak. Hold on. Slow down there. We're not weak. Katsu is changing his stance over there. It's like, oh, slow down, buddy. Okay, we're gonna need to defend our castle. Two months with the Shibata clan, that's not good. Oh, we're still cooperative, thank God for that. Oh, what an ugly loss, man. That was ugly. Raise. Um, no, it's all right. Horrible loss. I'm going to need these guys to stand here just to defend the castles. Because now I can't march till, I don't know, forever. Almost You almost lose half a year of progress, which is crazy. Damn Hideyoshi. I cannot believe I stalled out like that. That was... Oof. That was awful. Whoa. That was my controller. Yeah, that was... That felt like robbery. That felt like robbery on that one. I mean, because I based my strategy on that right side around that guy's tactic. And then for the game to be like, uh, technically, it literally counters Confuse only. Not tactics that inflict Confuse. It has to be keyword Confuse. So because he didn't counter that, he was supposed to counter that. He just crumbled. He got confused, he got beat up, and then he ran away. 
and that's what put everything into uh, dire straits. Otherwise, we would have been fine. You know, they wouldn't. He wouldn't have. Yoshitsugu wouldn't have been able to push down the right side. The whole thing could have been salvaged, but that that made it too much. That just that broke the camel's back right there. I didn't recognize that that was Yoshitsugu either. I didn't know that his portrait changes. And, uh, you know, that he get, gets leprosy and all that. Join the Oda clan. Alright. We're gonna have to have these guys squat here until the agitation's done. I'm just gonna put the speed up since we're basically frozen in place. This is gonna be like four months. We're not gonna get back. That's the worst thing about the authority. You know? Hopefully Koei adds like a an editor feature like they did with Romance 14. Where you can really uh, change the numbers on the systems. And how everything works. Because me personally, I would nerf authority triggers. Across the board. You know, I would just nerf them. They're way too strong on either side. They're too strong for the player. They're too strong for the AI. It doesn't matter. They're just way too punishing. Because... This game moves so fast. This game moves so fast. To lose six months because you can't march, that's a long time. You know what I mean? That's a long ass time not to be able to march. So there's almost too much banking on the authority. I'm sure it's there because they didn't want to do coalitions. So they were like, let's just do authority battles. Like, that's Koei's answer to, uh, how do we speed up conquering the map? Well, we'll just have authority battles. But I think you also need coalitions. I think you need both. You know, one's not going to cut it. You need both of them. We need to get this alliance done. Oh, man, we're untrusting. This is not good. If we can't get a deal done with Katsue, we're in trouble. Can you give titles to peep to uh to other daimyo? I don't remember if you could do that in this game. You can in other games, but I don't know about this game. I don't care. You can put all that on hold, Yusai. Put all that on hold. Well, what are you building? I can build it for you. No, you can't execute in this game. That'd be great if you could. Oh, man. That would be amazing if you could execute in this game. I think all you can do is exile. Exile's not, not as harsh, though. I don't even think it's his fault, really. I think it's just... It's Koei's fault. I mean, it's classic Koei. They're not... Koei has this knack for not being clear on how their game works. They make a game and they're just not clear on how it works. So, I mean, you know, that's why I made all those little tutorial videos when this game came out because I, I every time I experience this frustration because Koei's not clear, it pisses me off. You know? Cuz it's like you guys don't explain your stuff well at all. And you want people, and you're making a strategy game. You want people to put hours and hours into a campaign, and then get blindsided by something because you don't explain stuff well. You know, like come on, that's ridiculous. They could have easily added a line that says nullifies confusion. Parentheses or asterisk does not work against golden tactics. Done. Does not work against gold tactics. There it is, done. But they don't add that. You're just like, well, the player will know. Shit. 
the player will know. I barely know what's going on half the time. You know what I mean? I barely know who's winning and who's losing. You want me to know that I can't nullify golden confused tactics. Get out of here. I don't think I'm going to make the deadline. Oh, are we normal now? Okay, we're normal. Maybe we'll make the deadline with Katsue. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not, because this is a tempting target for him. Okay, hold on. We're going to have to put some soldiers. I don't know if this works or not. So, I don't know if this works or not. This is just a guess. This is what I used to do, like, in Three Kingdoms. If I suffer, like, a crushing defeat... I'll just have soldiers stand on top of a castle to prevent the AI from getting aggressive and going after the castle. So. I'm not sure that this is an actual deterrent in this game, but it, so far it's worked. I haven't been invaded when I do this, so. I'll say this, though. We, the run is in danger because... If you guys saw last week, like, we came out of the gate, dealt Hideyoshi two big uh, defeats, right? So, my momentum was going up like this, and now I've just ground to a halt. So, now I'm in trouble, because now Hideyoshi is going to actually be able to build up, you know? Now it's going to be a fair fight, and I wasn't trying to fight a fair fight against Hideyoshi. So, I'm in trouble now. kind of running out of time this guy looks familiar too Tokugawa retainer he served Ieyasu's eldest son Nobuyasu okay a lot of Tokugawa retainers showing up Tokugawa are going to collapse it's only a matter of time then we're going to have to face Nobukatsu so that's what I mean, like I'm running out of time. I had momentum on my side. <laughs> Not anymore. Occupied by another clan. Oh, we lost it. Okay, got it. Got it, got it. I don't want to put anybody here. This territory is really small. Sizel's castle. Nobody else? Okay. Sneak attack. Try. In sight? No. Okay, we got temple donation, which is good against sieges. And what else? Marine transport. All Connie's harvest plus 10%. Oh. Hey, this could solve our provisions. 10%? Okay, we're in the danger zone. Shibata truce has ended. Gotta cross our fingers and hope they don't invade. Castles don't recover. Oh shit, I didn't know that. I did not know that, Pizza. Yeah, you have to learn the hard way, it's true. Still, that's why I tried to kick out the tutorials for this game early. Just to try to lessen the impact of you having to learn everything the hard way. Because it's really discouraging to play a game like this and jump through hoops, right? Because that's how it feels. You, you learn eight things 
you do eight things correctly and you invested five or six hours but you forgot about that one thing because the game's not clear and so because you forgot that one thing you've just undone you know what i mean all your hours come crashing down everything that you've put into it so that's why i try to get those tutorials out to just get the basics down so people wouldn't have to uh smash their heads against the wall quite so much you know Wait, who does he have an alliance with? Nobukatsu? Mm, so they could be attacking us in the future as well. Don't even know what that guy was doing, I don't... Okay. All right, we're ready to march again. After all this time, soldiers aren't restored though. Just like you said, pizza, it's they're way low. Jeez, pathetically. Soldier counts are pathetically low. All right, I'll try to get a deal done with the Suzuki forces. Otherwise, I'm going to face an invasion from them and Nobukatsu. Our necromancer is still working. His magic. What did I miss here? Hideyoshi's territory is red, but I don't see why yet. Did we finish the policy? Can we upgrade it even further? Oh, you need eight trade ports. Holy crap. I guess the first one's just a freebie, huh? Let's get this, because we have a few stables already. Alright, as soon as we get some soldiers, we'll try this again. Okay, let's get a marriage alliance done with Katsue. I think he's the best pick, right, to get a marriage alliance done. I can't see us, um, I can't, I can't see anybody else being a good target for it. He's out of the way, he can help us with whatever's going on in, on the other side of the map. Seems perfect. Joso Kabe could also be good. How much labor do we have? We have four. No, I guess we'll expand the market. Alright, how are the soldiers looking? Not great. Not great. Okay. Oh, great. Damn hit a Yoshi, man. Hideyoshi and his nonsense. Oh, 
Wait, is this not a hex? Okay, that's a hex over there. Rebellions everywhere. Ooh, that's a nice horse. Plus three leadership, plus one valor. Ah, uh, okay. I gotta come back for it. It bankrupt me right now. You think so? Pizza? They are friendly. They have a fondness for Mitsuhide? Wow. Well. Well, what can I say? It's just... Just nice to be thought about. I appreciate it. Holy crap, what happened to the Ryosi clan? When I when I loaded this up, they were on top of the world. Looks like the Otomo got a deal done, huh? No? How did they get by? The Mori are looking pretty strong. Maybe we do need to get an alliance done with the Chosokabe against the Mori. Shimazu... No, it doesn't look like they're getting too crazy. Just yet. Yasu's almost finished. I bet if we start searching, let's start doing that. Once Yasu gets wiped out, if we start doing the searches, we'll start. We might start pulling some Tokugawa officers in time. Not right away, but in time. I'm just gonna have to remember to do that occasionally. Search, okay. All right, that looks good to me. Crops are too low. Insufficient crops for both of them, okay. Yeah, they probably will. Jimasu or the Mori. I kind of hope that they'd fight each other for a little while. I hope some, you know, whoever is winning doesn't just wipe out the other one, but. We still need a lot of soldiers. At least another two months away from marching. Unfortunately. Hideyoshi's taking the fight to Saika. Maybe now's her chance to do something. We're not even done repressing, though. Okay, that's going to increase our harvest. He's not winning. Nobody's winning here. That's good at least. They're deadlocked there. The Oda and the Hojo are fighting each other, which is great. They haven't allied with each other. That'd be a disaster. Right. Rebellion's done. We got one more month to go. Yari 
One more month and then we can launch another attack. Hopefully it'll go a lot better than this that first one. Because that was an embarrassment. Total embarrassment. What is this shit, guys? Are you serious? Stop three castles from being able to march? How do you even do that? That's shocking. Oh my god, Hideyoshi's nonsense he just agitated three of our castles through subterfuge i don't even know how he did it i don't even know how he did that that's crazy that's not raise that's not destroy so you have hanzo hitori over there what? Oh, that was so good. Cause I'm I'm about ready to march, and he just took my reinforcements off the table. Everything from up here, he just took them off the table like that. Damn. Either way, we need to march, so. Month's almost over. We have to go. This will be Mune Mori's chance to redeem himself. Need to damn counties back. Remember, Yuki's at 2,000. Jidoi's almost full. Okay, so he's about ready to march. We will gather our forces once again. Try to punch through Hideyoshi's front. Who else can I pull into this battle? Yakami Castle seems to be the only other place. I don't want to do that. All right, he didn't mean to. We have a small force back. Let's get everybody gathered here. Hideyoshi thinks we're going to attack here, but we're not. We're going to go towards uh, Hanakuma. Mission complete. No, we're not done yet. We're going to go this way. 
border dispute. Take care of that. Okay, Alliance done with the Suzuki plan, that's good. No authority trigger. You don't have four units, Hideyoshi. One, two, three. He's almost got four. There we go. Okay, 25 against 15. We should have this. Yeah, you think it's a Kanbei plot? It probably is, bro. It probably is. Nagamasa Kuroda's on the battlefield. All right. So father and son, as well as Hideyoshi. I think this is the guy we injured. He's probably not injured anymore. This guy's terrible. I think we're going to send him on the right side. He can just capture some points for us. Stats are like 20. Let's try this. Let's get our revenge. Vengeance. Alright, is he gonna go for the hill? That's what I'm wondering. Nope. I don't think we even need to take the hill because these guys don't have a lot of soldiers so we shouldn't really drain our stamina. I think it's more important to threaten the camp. So I'm going to beeline him towards the camp. Try to get Hideyoshi to turn around. See, Hideyoshi's going to do a lot of damage here. If he gets involved, I don't know. Can you go get Kanbei? Okay, can you go get Kanbei? Nobody can go get Kanbei? 
But he's got to deal with Kanbei. He's on the loose. Alright, just stay right there. Man, I thought I told this guy to stay right where he was. Did I not? Come on, Mitsuhide, you need to break the deadlock already. Finally. Alright, turn around. Let's get Hideyoshi. Musket fire from behind. Just riddled with bullets. Gonna get away. Don't let him get away. Kind of uh, risking a lot here just to try to get Hideyoshi. I can't believe this guy. Again, he runs away very early into the fight. I can't believe he ran away so quickly. Alright, if we capture Kanbei, at least it'll be something. Yeah, I see that, but they're all confused, though. <laughs> <sighs> I'm 
Can't believe you ran away again. Mune Nori. Not a very good unit. Kind of a trap unit. capture Kanbei either. Man, we didn't get anything for this battle. We got the authority trigger, but that's it. Tough battle. All right, we got our at least we got a revenge win. Our castles are no longer agitated, so we can at least march from there, too. All right, maybe we can at least take this one. Provisions are almost ready. Okay, that's good. That's going to be a first. Yeah, we managed to stall it out. Barely. Barely, because uh, that Musomori guy runs away very early in the fights. Suspiciously early. You, I almost think he's like a double agent or something. I'm like, what are you doing? You bar the, the battle barely started, and he's withdrawing. Like, he's literally creating crisis points. So, I don't think I'm going to deploy that guy anymore. Uh, you might as well just keep going straight. It's just going to take too long to turn around. Who did we find? Shigemasa Oyamada. Quite, oh, this is a Takeda officer, right? Takeda retainer, yeah. Okay, we got a Takeda retainer. Storm. I don't think we should storm because we're going to lose uh, too many troops. Hold off on the storm there. Come on, we need help. We need help. Hideyoshi's got more people on the way. All right, Yusai, you old troublemaker. Let's go. Get everybody. No gold. Okay, marriage alliance with the Shibata clan.
with his son, of course, not Katsue himself. That'd be a little creepy, man. She's 16. That's, like, way too, uh... There we go. I wish there was a little bit more to that. Okay, let's search. You never know who's going to turn up, so... So we've officially joined our houses. Shibata and the Kechi. That's got a nice ring to it. Alright. Anything else we can get built while we're just sitting around with all this excess? Okay. Build up Saiso's domain. I know I haven't been able to use them yet effectively, but sooner or later. I wish I had him right now. Yoshitsugu. Oh yeah, his eyes colored different. I don't know if you guys can see, but his eyes are actually different colors. I wonder if that's uh, the leprosy, like Ikari was saying. Okay, this should be an easy battle. Get the speed up. I wish we had a speed four. Need one more speed, you know? One more speed setting. Try to capture some of these guys. These are Hideyoshi's best retainers right now. Yeah, that wasn't great, but... Where's he going? Through the camp? Okay. Okay, Nagamasa. Oh, that's not Nagamasa. Yoshia Kira. I thought that was Nagamasa Kuroda. Where is Yoshitsugu going, man? He's just charging at the base? Hi. 
Don't let him beat you. Ooh, just caught him. Oh, confusion. Hate it. Hate it, hate it, hate it. Man, Mitsuhide's tactic just feels so weak. It just feels so weak. It needs a buff or something. You know, it needs to get... I don't know. It needs to charge faster. At least make it charge faster. Oh, your cat's keeping you awake, Ikari. You, it's a, does it have the... Uh, What's it called? The zoomies? Howling and all that. Oh my god. Oh shit. Yoshitsugu is murdering me. Terrible. All right. Should be we should be destroying him at least in a second here. Thank goodness. Didn't capture him. Didn't kill him. That means I have to deal with him another day. Great. Oh, okay. He's older. Well, I was just saying, Ikari, before he pops back in, that um, Yoshitsugu seems to have, like, one of his eyes looks dead. So I wonder if that's the leprosy. One of them's, uh, yeah, it just looks like a dead eye. If you look at his portrait closely, you can see the color difference between them, between the two. Now Mori, um, okay, we'll just release him. If you give him purple, oh man, thanks. Thanks, Boomer, I appreciate that. I forgot that completely. Maybe that'll fix him a little bit. It just, it, right now it's very underwhelming. The attack, the bonus, the actual buff to his unit is not very strong. I know that the intention is to make it feel very strong, but it's not. It's very lackluster. And his tactic takes way too long to charge. Like, extremely long. Hideyoshi... I know Hideyoshi is not the greatest comparison, but... Hideyoshi... And even uh, Yoshitsugu, for example. All the other guys who have gold-plated tactics, they charge much faster. Mitsuhide's tactic feels very, very slow. So... If you guys haven't used them, <laughs> the fair warning, it's gonna be... It doesn't feel very strong at all. It feels underwhelming, you know? Especially for the title. It's called Now is the Time. That should have some gravitas to it, right? You know, the title's got it. So, okay, so make it make the effect big. If it's going to take a long time, time to charge, that's fine. But just make it hit harder. Make that buff insane. Otherwise, shorten it. Oh, the... Really, you're going to call in your Ukita allies? They only have four castles. Embarrassing. Have you no honor, Hideyoshi? You're going to sacrifice their lives, huh? Okay, I don't think I need to fight this. 
You say you can block the road. You haven't done anything. You've done nothing, sir. You can block the road for a little while. In sight. I don't know. I don't think that that's necessary. Come on, let's go. Let's get this castle. There we go. Yeah, you could. You could. Yeah, this game is very punishing for not playing your own battles out. It's a little bit frustrating because um, sometimes some of these battles are you just, you know, you're just uh, cleaning up. So it can feel a little tedious sometimes to do that. Let's try to take one more. <laughs> What about the island? Nah, it's going to be too hard to defend. Actually, I, I, and also, I don't like the idea of being getting too close to the Chosokabe clan just yet. Like, I'm not, th <laughs> I'm not that strong. Yeah, and this one, it's like a balancing act because you get punished pretty severely for. Um, it feels like you get punished severely, anyway. For not fighting the battle, so. Two more ports we can add. Let's do it. Well, one more port. We only have four. Nobuyuki, where are you? Where are you, Sanada? You're just in time to deliver the the coup de gras. Just when we're running out of steam, here comes the Sonata. Oh, look at that. No provisions. Interesting. Mitsuhide is going to run out of provisions, so I'm just going to have him squat on this castle. Hmm, this guy's got repair. Alright. His provision should hold. And so if I get a battle, I'll just charge Mitsuhide out with his last days of provisions just to fight the battle. Hidemitsu's running out. I think I can send Hidemitsu back. Oh yeah, combine the best of both worlds, that'd be great. Yes, we'll take anybody. Well, hold on, I spoke too soon. Hey God, I spoke to Zoot. Hold on. 45, 43, 39, 25. And he has speedy.
73 years old. No, I'm alright. We're okay. Thanks, but no thanks. Come on, guys, let's go. Let's get one more castle. Here comes Canvey. Canvey to the rescue. If only Sisal's province was ready to march. It's not, though. <clears throat> Need some money to extract. Alright, that's fine. Blockading. Um, yeah, we're never going to break through there. Just, uh, just storm it. Well, you know what? Let's route. We're going to have to route um, Kanbei first. Is that all the help he's sending? Oh, nope. Nagamasa's on his way and so is Masanori. Oh, so the cream... The cream of the crops on the way. They're too far away. So they're too far away from each other. Mitsuhide has only got one march in them. Kanbei is going to completely destroy our forces by himself, too. You just know that he is. I hate these positions of... I hate these spots that you get stuck in. Alright, fall back a bit. This is stupid, but I'm gonna have to fight it. Yeah, you could set up a supply line in in uh, Spear of Influence. I remember that. You can kind of chain your castles together like that, so you'd have max supplies as you're marching. It was a little gamey, but I don't know if the system's any better, you know? Sometimes I feel like this system has a lot of roadblocks to prevent the player from progressing too rapidly. Like, they needlessly change some things in this game to add... I hate to say it, but it feels like they added padding in some spots. Because they don't want the game to flow too quickly? I don't know. I don't know what Koei's thinking is on that, but... You know, like the true system... I've already talked about it like ad nauseum, but the true system is, is clearly designed to be against the player, just to prevent the player from expanding too quickly. And it's like, who cares if you expand too quickly? You know what I mean? Like, this is a single player game. Like, what is what does Koei care? Like, <laughs> if you're winning too quickly, you know, it's just such a strange thing to put these roadblocks in. And that's how the provision system feels. The provision system feels like you gotta really. I don't want to go too far, but. Let Mitsuhide take the brunt of it. His, <laughs> his guys are starving anyway. Reminds me of Sao Tsao when he's marching the uh, people back from Chu province. He's like, less mouths to feed. I think he does that a few times, actually. I don't want to spoil it, Ikari, because I know you haven't read the novels, but... Sao does some pretty, uh... Pretty questionable things to get out of his, uh... To get through his provision problems. <laughs> Alright. There's like water. We run the rotation. Oh. 
You gotta catch him. Don't let him clear. Don't let him clear. Perfect. Pincer stuck. Love to see it. It's crazy, but this feels a lot more difficult than the Nobunaga survives Honganji. You would think that one would be tougher, but no, this feels tougher. This feels like you can't get any traction going. Like, it's very difficult. Yeah, the true system is busted, man. It's ridiculous. Like I said, it's just designed for the AI to stop you from expanding. And uh, I don't understand that. Alright, do we have enough to take the castle? I don't think so. Mitsuhiri's got three days of provisions. Let's see if we can get back. Border dispute. Oh, uh, if you guys haven't subbed to the channel, make sure you sub to the channel. We, I'm doing this. This is the live stream. We're doing this every uh, weekend, and I'm also doing a Mazuyuki playthrough, and we're also doing a Yuan Chu playthrough in Romance 14. I think I've also got figured out what I'm gonna do next. The next live stream pay playthrough. I think I know what I'm gonna do. Um. And that one's going to be pretty epic as well. Yeah, I have to withdraw. I can't. I don't think I could make the dash. I don't think I'd survive, like, making the dash. We'd just get routed. So I'm not going to be able to command this battle, so we should probably just run. Alright, let's see what else is going on. So we're allied with the Shibata clan. And, and sure enough, they never stopped fighting. Once I had Katsue attack Mino province, he's never stopped. So now Nobukatsu and Katsue are perpetually locked in this battle, which is great for me. So that means I'm going to just stay alive. I'm not going to have to worry about Nobukatsu. Wow, oh, look at his numbers. Everything's over here dealing with Katsue, man. This is perfect. We're just free to deal with Hideyoshi. Hideyoshi's got no help. Let's get this port. No money. Right. Of course. Of course. No, we didn't get the enemy general. And Ikari, they'll never improve their AI. <laughs> never improve it. Nobody improves their AI. If you look at all these developers, all these video game companies now, improving AI, improving AI actually takes effort. And um, all these developers have realized that all they have to do is improve the graphics. You know what I mean? And uh, we're gonna keep buying the games. There's, they have to, they, they don't have to put. They don't have to put almost no effort into improving their games anymore. All they have to do is just improve the graphics and add us, you know, add a few mechanics once in a while and that's it. But as far as AI, you're never going to get improved AI. It's you'll get some patches to some obvious fixes, but you'll never get like you know it's just never going to happen. But it's not just Koei that's alone in this. That's This is every developer. My brother uh, is a big uh, football player. He plays the Madden titles. And he, he calls it the EA Sports method. Where it's like add a bunch of features. Take a bunch of features out for a couple of years. Update the graphics. Add some of the features back after a couple of years. People forget that the features were in there before, right? And then people praise the features that were in five years ago. 
because players either move on or they just don't remember or they're coping whatever the reason is and they just rinse and repeat bro they rinse and repeat so that's where we're at I mean I think this is a, as good as it gets I don't know why though I don't know if I don't know I'm assuming money's behind it maybe it, it costs a lot more to program smart AI I don't know but all video games are like this now it's hard to get decent AI is he really okay I thought he was gonna attack I'm like are you serious I'm not ready <laughs> I'm like this is not fair I'm not ready stop Stop. Time out. Oh yeah, but the next playthrough, the next live stream playthrough on the channel, I'm probably going to start it in January, so. And I think you guys are going to like that one. That one's going to be a very difficult one. <laughs> it's going to be a tough one. It's going to be a fun one. So. What do you want? Uh, okay. He's probably going to ask me for help. It's just the battles? Yeah. I haven't played Ascension. I have Ascension as well. That was weird. They just sat there and then they turned around. Expand market. Um, all right, let's do that. Rumor. Try it. Are we ready to march? One more month, I think, and we can go for the next castle. It's just great that Katsue and Nobukatsu are... trading blows over here. I don't have to deal with any of it. Ieyasu's struggling to survive. This is just the best case scenario. We're absolutely getting the best case scenario right now. Where's this guy going? Where are all these guys going? The Mori clan's attacking. Mori clan's going to war with Hideyoshi. Oh, I think that's it. I think that's it for Hideyoshi. He's not going to be able to hold everybody off like that. Okay. Every county is, yep. Let's extract the guy. Okay, Mori's attack's almost over. I guess we'll try to take this castle. Okay, 
に手に入れまするどうかご命令を城を奪ってみせますおげちを願いまする遅れずついてまいれWe'll try to take that one and then let's march from out here and try to finish taking uh, Miki finally. We have provisions, right? Yes. Noble Yuki's ready to march. Sana does pretty much our good luck charm, if you think about it. He's pretty much he pretty much guarantees we survive. We win most of our encounters. I'm kind of surprised the Mori decided to actually attack, though. I didn't think that they would. Let's bring in the Necromancer, because why not? Hidemitsu is ready to go. Alright, let's go. Where else can I pull people from? I kind of wish I could command two battles because I'd love to send, I'd love to send Mitu, uh, Mitsuhide over here, <laughs> like as reinforcement, and just crush Nobukatsu's armies, like help Katsue just mop up. But I think Katsue is doing a pretty good job by himself. He's a one-man wrecking crew. All right. Oh, you really formed an alliance with uh, Hideyoshi? You submitted to the Toyotomi? I mean, to the Hashiba? Wow. How embarrassing. Look at all these little guys. Who's in this castle? Alright, let's crush these guys. Crush the reinforcements. Max Castle Raider? Um, I'm not sure what you mean by that, Boomer. The blockade? The castle blockade uh, buff? You know what? You can lead because your, your castle is right next door anyway, so you can take the attrition. <laughs> Lerman. Ooh, double salvo. And now they're caught in a pincer. See if we can capture Kanbei. Oh, that's a tribe unit. 
That doesn't really matter then. Alright, we gotta wait for Kanbei to use his like water. We'll have the Necro take that hit. Then we'll send in the Sanada. The Sanada kid. Maybe we could capture Kanbei? Now is the time to say no to Confuse. We fulfilled our obligation, if you say so. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Got you. Yeah, I didn't click. Yeah, you're talking about the trait, right? Like, just stack it on top of each other to deal maximum damage. We still got Kiyomasa and Sakon. You know what? That's not going to be too easy. To fight those two. Mm. How many can you bring? Hi. Two thousand. No, it's not much. We haven't deployed from Azuki Castle. I think only one time. None of these guys are great underneath them. I wanted to send two units, but... Our destroy actually worked. No shit. Or was it raise? I think it was raise. Still. Alright, we gotta deal with them. And then up here... Yusai was not engaging the castle for some reason. Of course not. I wonder if Saiso can block the road here. Should he hit the cat? I guess he'll hit the castle. We should be able to route Kisomasa easily. Sakon's by himself. Oh, what did I... It's fine, we don't need him. But no officer. <laughs> I don't want to imagine, that sounds like a nightmare. Sounds like an absolute nightmare, Ikari. No officers at all? Sounds like Ujizane mode, but extreme. Extreme Ujizane mode. Just take too much damage, man. Oh, I hate it. Just one unit, but you have to deal with it. 
One man army, yeah. The Katsue Shibata challenge. The solo challenge. Alright, maybe we can capture Sakon, who knows. It's possible, I guess. Try to get around them. Try to swing around. First blood. I can't believe the Sutsui would even take the field against me after I saved them two times. Especially last week. Last week they had like, what was it, like 200 soldiers? And we routed Nobukatsu's armies for them. They have no shame. And I wish we could get Sakon Chima on our team. Speaking of maps, we're supposed to get like 10 more maps. According to uh, Koi's website, they're going to add 10 more this month. So. They didn't have anything else on their patch notes, but still. It's something. Okay, we got that surrounded. Storming the hell out of this castle. I don't know if we're going to be able to take it, though. Mune Yuri agrees deeply aggrieved. It would not be surprised if they walk out on. I say let him go. I don't want that loser. Oh, I can counter confuse. He's lucky he wasn't executed. Executed for war crimes. Okay, I don't think we're going to take this, but... We did inflict some casualties, so that's good. He's holding his own, actually. Maybe he might take it. How are we doing here? Oh, we're just pummeling this into the ground. Yeah, executed for false uh, advertisement. That's right. Hideyoshi's brother. We're going to execute him. Uh, those two can go. 
This guy I want executed. I think it's Hideyoshi's brother, right? Uh, those guys can go. Well done. Ashiba's power is pretty much broken. The turning point was the Mori attacking. I didn't think the Mori would gonna attack. Okay, let's put somebody in charge. Who is worthy? Actually, let's put him. He has Confuse. He has the power of Confuse Abuse. Okay. Blockading, just storm it. Isn't the defense low enough? Shibata clan. Reinforcements. Yep. We'll send Katsue all the reinforcements he needs. I'd go myself if I wasn't busy dealing with uh, Hideyoshi. Uh, no, we want the... This guy's sick. He's 74. No, we don't want him. Stop suggesting him. We don't want him. There we go. Two castles. Who do we capture? Cannot serve me, okay. Don't be so dramatic. I cannot serve you. Where's he? Oh, I see Yasu. <laughs> Yasu's almost done. Two castles left. But you know Ieyasu can do a lot with two castles, so... Let's not count him out just yet. No, we don't. I don't want this guy. Are you actually going to keep recommending him, or what? Okay. Nine castles left. We're at 17. Man, I'm looking pretty strong right now. Now, can I fend off an invasion? No, but <laughs> strong enough to beat up on uh, Hideyoshi. All right, guys, I'm going to call it there. Uh, I'll be back uh, next week with some more of, the, of this live playthrough. Like I said, if you haven't subbed to the channel, make sure you sub to the channel. Make sure you like the stream. Uh, leave me a comment. You know, all that good stuff. We'll be back with more of this next week. We'll have Mazuyuki playthrough. It's going on on the channel right now. And that's going pretty well. Second attempt is going a lot better than the first attempt. And we've got the Yuan Chu playthrough. Uh, where I'm overthrowing Wu right now. Or at least trying to. I'm kind of on a time clock on that one. If I can't take down Wu before Cao Cao routes Lu Bu. Uh, you know. That, that one's going to go south too. But um, yeah. Thanks for stopping by. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Until then. Take care.